My name's Kylie Harvey. I'm an artist living in Cobar. I work across a wide range of mediums, painting, drawing and textile art. We're going to have a look at creating this little piece of wearable textile art. This brooch is made from a few different bits of recycled and reclaimed materials, some lonely buttons and a few simple stitches. I hope you can make one too. Some of the things we're going to need to create our piece of textile art are a good sharp little pair of scissors. I like using a pair of pinking shears, you get that nice crinkled edge. Uh, some needles, pins are really handy so you can hold things together. Um, different little bits of what others might see as waste textiles. So there's, you know, worn out tablecloths, vintage doilies that someone else has cut the embroidery out of, um, buttons that no longer have a home that you find in the washing. Um, I've just got a vintage Suffolk puff there. You're going to need some different threads, um, just embroidery threads or different weights of thread to thicknesses and they're really good for adding texture. You're going to need some little pins or a brooch back. Um, you can use old bits of textile, uh, some old laces or you know bits you've cut off other things. I've tea dyed those. Okay so let's get going. Um, I often like to put mine on a base of felted wool as well. So I've bought these specially, but if you have an old jumper that you've accidentally put through the wash, they are fantastic for this too. So let's get going. I'm just going to play around with these for a little while. Um, I'm going to probably stitch around the edge of that one. Now, when it comes to your stitching, you can see that my stitches really are not exact. They're very naive, and that's the look I'm going for. There's different um, types of stitches I love using, like French knots or Lazy Daisy stitches. If you don't know how to do those, there's lots and lots of great YouTube tutorials about those that you can look up. Okay, so we might get going. I'm just going to play around for a little while. around the edge of some of the base layers and it's time to put it all together and this is the really the fun part um, I like to include some little words or something on my little brooches so I've just stitched the word maker on that one and I'm just going to spend some time layering it up seeing what works and stitching it together I've just stitched that little pin on very roughly at the top of this little brooch and I think that's hmm, I'm happy with that thanks for joining me as I created this little piece of wearable textile art I'd love to see what you create you can find me as indigo and quince on Instagram where I share my creative adventures and I'd love to meet you there thanks bye Thank you.